Hey guys, so I'm starting a new vlog. Just got to the city. I parked like four blocks from my dad's because there's no parking nowhere. Um, this is my handy with my bun buns. I hope you guys enjoy the vlogs. Um, I had a lot of fun doing them. I feel like I got a little bit better at um, vlogging in public. Even though, you know, when you're in a place where like where I was, they don't know me. It's not like I'm here in the neighborhood trying to do this and run into someone asking me, what the hell are you doing? But I'm enjoying the vlogs. So I packed myself an iced coffee. But yesterday, this might be too, too TMI, but yesterday I drank me one of those, um, the pulgante. The... Um, like those laxative things that you use to you know clean your system out because I feel like everywhere that we went because I can't eat seafood I was eating a lot of like steak and ribs and like meat not really like healthy stuff because a lot of it was seafood and I can't eat that so I came back feeling so bloated and it could be also the drinks and stuff but like last night I was just like in the bathroom and then this morning I felt fine I got my iced coffee hit the road once I hit the road I felt like the chills and I was like oh my god but I'm good I'm heading up to my dad's now my sister should be on her way mm, like an hour or so so I'm gonna see if he ate breakfast you know, he's been sleeping a lot more since he stopped taking, um, since he stopped the coffee. Like now what we give him is chocolate milk, like hot chocolate milk. We add a little bit of nutmeg and he thinks it's coffee. But I feel like because he's not having like six and seven cups of coffee a day, he's been sleepier and taking little naps here and there. So I think he's up already, but we're going to see. So, I'll see you when I get upstairs or when my sister gets home. Maybe we'll have a drink later. And I'll show you. Alright, so we picked up the Bacardi Pina Colada. This one called Royal Nine Cocktail in Watermelon. This Bacardi Mojito, which we had last time, which I loved. This one, Sunset from Ciroc. This is vodka. And then we got these watermelon ones to try. So, which one do you want to start with? Uh, I want the watermelon. Watermelon? Okay, we're going to start with you. I think this is like my fifth or sixth we trying to take one by one, but the mojitos slamming, the pina coladas slamming, everything else I feel is like, if you had the Budweiser limeritas and you know that acidy taste, I feel like that's what we're tasting, but... Then again, I feel like I'm the only one drinking it. Okay. <clears throat> so I'm filling up another one of the Bacardi Mojitos. I didn't really care for the watermelon one. I feel like it needed a little bit of help. Kind of like a little bit more of the Bacardi. The Pina Colada was very good. The other one, mm, but this one was good. And if you wanted to add like a little bit of the Bacardi to it, you can do that because that was good. But I feel like this alone was just fine. So I think there's only two bottles left after the 10 that we've tried out. I feel like this one, the pina colada the watermelon if you add something to it maybe it's good 
but I feel like the other ones were a little bit weak. So, if I'm slurring, it's not because this, but I think this was pretty good, so try it out. Hey guys, how are you? It is another day. It's actually Tuesday. I went back to work yesterday and my first day back, I was ready for another vacation. You know, I came back and I, all my passwords had expired. I was drawing a blank with everything. Like I was like, what is going on? But it's nice to be back home in your routine, in your own bed, in your own space. Like, I feel like when you're on vacation, it's great. But when you're living out of a suitcase and you don't have, like, all your stuff, it could be, like... I did a couple of maps, so I feel like my face is a lot better. Because it, I was feeling like it was not happy. But I feel like it's a lot better now. Um, heading home. I'm out to lunch. I was also trying to clean out a lot of my stuff like I was going through my closet and stuff trying to get rid of some some stuff because I was saying I want to get those Alex drawers the closet not the drawers the um the Ikea pack system but I want it to look nice and like not packed like you know I've been watching a lot of videos of people and they have it in their background and I love that you can see everything like their blouses and their dresses and like blazers and everything and everything looks nice and neat so I want to do it where it's like that and it doesn't get where it's like super packed and it just looks a mess you know I want to be able to move the clothes you know but I find it so hard to get rid of stuff like I was looking at the blouses and I was like eh, I don't really use that but yes I do I don't really need this but yes I do so I think what I have to do is like like I know a lot of my patterns and my clothes are very like bright and like bold which I know I like then I have a lot of solid pieces that I don't really reach for but it's always good to have like you know basics so I'm gonna go through a lot of the stuff because I have a couple of like leggings and stuff and I must have like over 25 but I keep wearing like the same three so like I need to get rid of stuff like that so once I start putting stuff in the drawers I feel like everything will be nice and organized I do want that to be my background for fashion um hauls and stuff like that so I want it to look nice and like boutique kind of not really like in your closet like I want it to look like I'm in a boutique and I'm showing you you know what I got so tomorrow I was gonna do it today but I'm not doing that today tomorrow I have a box of stuff that I already packed up and stuff that I want to take to Goodwill and when I come back I'm gonna go through my drawers and put stuff in there to get rid of um, I took a couple of things to my sister and I'm gonna take I gave a few to some friends but everything else I'm gonna just you know take to goodwill because I don't want it to get like you know sometimes I buy stuff that calls my gets my attention and I'm like oh I want that but I don't always think well that's not true like I'll see stuff and I'll be like oh that'll look nice with these jeans or look like with these pants like I already have a look in mind but when it comes time to like put it together the jeans don't really look the way I thought it was with the stuff so then I end up with a lot of pieces that I don't really you know I don't have anything that goes with it and then I have to buy more stuff to have to go with it so I want to have like you know white pants green pants blue pants red pants beige you know all the different shades of jeans and stuff that I can mix and match things and I want to have stuff because I have a lot of jeans that I don't wear because some of them are either too tight some of them are like 
tight in the wrong places like it's tight on my butt but then on my thighs and stuff it's loose so i don't like it so i don't wear it but instead of getting rid of it i just like tuck it away tuck it away tuck it away so i want to get rid of stuff that i don't love you know and i know that i have things that you know when i'm cleaning that's for when i'm cleaning or if i'm doing yard work that's for like yard work but a lot of it is stuff that i don't wear because i don't like how you fit so stuff like that i want to get rid of and i know there's a lot of stuff that i have to get rid of and you know you always think this is tight but you know if i lose weight it's gonna fit fine blah, blah, blah. but when you lose weight then you want a different kind of look you know you want something different so that's what i'm gonna do but i'm home i'm gonna make me some lunch i only got about 30 minutes and then we shall see so uh, most likely on my way out of work when i hit the stores because i gotta go food shopping and check out a couple of things i might pick you up if not then i'll pick you up when i'm doing something that's actually fun so just got out of work i'm in walmart they got the bathing suits on clearance and they already got the coats out so now i'm upset now i'm sad so i saw something like this on tiktok fashions for walmart but no these are pretty with chancletas but I think they got like separates and I don't see any separates they're over here let me see so uh, I don't think I like this though but it was like a skirt like the matching top and skirt and very loud like that so as you can see they got like a lot of the summer stuff on rollback clearance we still got the whole month of august oh this one i think it is let me see this this is pretty for 26 bucks though oh, really let me see what I see. These are pretty. So I'm in the fit room and I have these three that I want to try. I'm going to show you how they look as I tried them on. This is the first one. I like it. It's flowy, but I feel like here it isn't as loose. Like maybe I should have went up one size. This is 26, but I think it's on clearance. But that's how that one is. On to the next. This is the next one. Don't mind my straps. But this is pretty. Like. This is the last one. I love this. And this one you can wear like that off the shoulder. If you want like or you can wear it like this. Like that. I like this one. This one says Twenty-seven ninety-eight. But I feel I like this. Which one is your favorite? I think this is my favorite. So just got out of work. This is my outfit. And I really like these, but I think I want this one. 
I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see if it's on sale and clearance like everything else. If not, I'm not paying twenty seven dollars. So I ended up going with the last one, which was the big long one. I just love the color. That's the one I actually saw on TikTok. So now we're going to Marshalls. I just want to see something. So let's go. Looks like they're doing some kind of construction. So I don't know where the stuff is. All right. I didn't get nothing in Marshalls. Um, I don't have patience when they're doing construction or moving stuff and things like that to be looking for where you put the stuff at. So I looked around. I saw a couple of dresses that I like, but they were like 40 and 50 bucks. They were from Tahari, which were, they were very beautiful. One of them looked like the one I got, but I wasn't going to spend 50 bucks. So I'm kind of glad that I paid 20 bucks for it. So the last one that I tried that was like that was $27.98. And when I scanned it, it was $19. But I was like, you know what? I'll get it. I'm going to use it. I love the color. I'm sure I'll use it next year because I feel like they're just like classic, beautiful summer dresses. So right now, I'm going to head home. And... I'm going to head home. I don't think I'm gonna come back because I wanted to do like a little vlog. You know, I showed you guys I was in the city. We got some more of those drinks because they were good and they were hitting. I tried the other flavors. I think I'm gonna just stick with my mojito or the watermelon one. The other ones I don't really care for, but they were good. I don't find them up here in Connecticut. Like, I, there's a liquor store over here next to the Marshalls that I don't see that they have them. And there was another one near my job that I didn't see them either. So, I don't know if that's something that I'm only going to find when I'm in the city. So, maybe I'll pick some up and bring some home. But, that's it for now. I went into the Marshalls. I don't think I wanted to TJ Maxx. I wanted to get, like, a quick... Um, you know like one of those either um i wanted a foundation like my color now because the ones i got are a little light and then i have one that's super dark but i'm not that dark so i wanted something quick because if i don't go back to the beach i'm gonna start fading um so i didn't want to spend too much on um a new foundation if i wasn't gonna you know, it's not like it's my normal color. I don't know what is up with the people today. They're driving all crazy. So, I didn't want to spend too much. I wanted to spend maybe, you know, 10 bucks. But maybe I'll go and get the Elf um, Camel. I don't know. A little bit darker and see how that goes. I was gonna tell you something else. Oh, I just noticed you saw in Walmart that um, they were they were um, they already got the coats out. They got the bathing suits on clearance. They got the coats out. You still got another week in July. You got the whole month of August. Usually in August it's super hot, and they already got coats out. And I'm kind of sad because I feel like the summer just you wait for it for so long. And then it just like it's done. So I wasn't gonna get the dress because I was like, you know, I saw the coats and I was like, summer's over. But then I was like, no, oh, I want that dress. Maybe I wear it. Um, maybe I wear it this weekend, even though I gotta work Saturday and I have to keep it up. But I just want to wear it. I want to get at least two uses out of it before I have to pack them up.
there's a lot I have to do still. I just came back from vacation, so like I washed all our clothes. I got that out the way, but I want to do like some cleaning around the house. I want to probably change the decor from blue to pink or yellow. Um, I don't know yet, but I just want to do like a refresher and like switch it up. So that's probably what I'll do in the next few days. And I gotta do food shopping tomorrow. Tomorrow I get paid. So I'll do some food shopping and we'll see. Maybe I'll pick up a new vlog tomorrow. Maybe I'll start one tomorrow or I don't know yet. So anyways, let me stop Jimmy Chapman and let you go. I will see you guys in my next